Well, summer just getting started here in San Francisco and in other spots around the Bay Area. September, of course, considered one of the best weather months of all, all the year round in parts of the Bay Area. And here today is San Francisco Community Manager Abby Schwartz with uh, some of Yelper's favorite summertime treats as we head into what most people consider the fall, but in San Francisco and in other spots, summer. Right, and we I, we always joke bye bye Fogus. <laughs> yes, hello exactly. September summer. <laughs> yes. So why not talk about some sweet treats that we can always enjoy? And we're going to start in the Mission District. Yes. So one of the great things about Yelp, if you go to the website mm -hmm. on the home page, there's a section called Hot New Businesses. So a hot new business in San Francisco is the Velvet Scoop. Sounds great. They've just been open for about a week, and they already have close to 10 to 15 five star reviews already from wow. people like myself that are Midwesterners. <laughs> that can attest to good custard. That is a big deal in the Midwest, isn't yes, it? Yes, I yeah. used to live in St. Louis, and Ted mm -hmm. Drew's is a St. Louis institution. Ah, so and this comes close? This does come close according to the Yelpers and myself. I've tried it. Yeah. They also do concretes, which is another Midwestern custard What thing. is that? Someone actually articulated it's kind of like a blizzard, only way better, made with custard and all those goodies in between. And then they freeze it so it's nice and hard. Oh. And you scoop it out with a spoon. It is phenomenal. It sounds decadent. Go get a concrete at the Velvet <laughs> Scoop. You won't regret it. Okay. And, and as you mentioned, they haven't been around very long, but already uh, getting some rave reviews. Yes. All right. Well, let's move to the East Bay. Yes. So, uh, Nieves, uh -huh. have you ever had a... Uh, Mangonada? I had never heard of a mangonada until I, this morning. I hadn't either. <laughs> Yelpers like to track down cool little food tidbits. And so at uh, Nieves, you can get a mangonada, which it's like an ice cream sundae, but it's mm -hmm. with fresh mango, uh -huh. mango sorbet, shave ice, chamoy sauce, a tamarind straw, and some chili powder wow. on top. There's so a lot going on there. A lot of flavor, but Yelpers will argue that this might be the best mangonada you can get in the Bay Area. Really? It's 350, so it doesn't hurt to go give it a try. Not at all. That's high praise, though. And there's a churro shop right outside, so if that's not enough for you, just go get a soft, fresh-baked churro and just pop it on there. Well, you can't lose with that. All right, so that's going on in Oakland, right? Yes. All right, let's move to the South Bay. Foodie trend alert. You heard uh -huh. it here first from okay. the Yelpers. Uh-huh. Snow ice, which is different than shave ice. Oh, it's not the same. Oh, no. The same. Oh, so look Snow at that. is in uh, Mountain View, and they have a location in San Jose too. So it's mm -hmm. like a block of goodness frozen, and then they have yeah. this proprietary tool where they shave the goodness into little ribbons, oh, and they do these unique beautiful. flavors. I know it's a work of art. And Seems a shame to eat it. No, never a shame <laughs> to eat no, it. Don't go that far. No, yet. and so <laughs> you can get all these really unique flavors like taro, black sesame, green mm. tea, and then these fresh goodness on top. And uh, Yelpers say just go ahead and splurge for the condensed milk on the top. So, oh, really? Yes. Yeah, you're there. You might as well do it. It's called Snow, Snow Zen, of course. Snow Zen. And uh, I, w I will guess you'll probably see more of this snow ice happening in the Bay Area in the next year or so. I, I think would, it's a hot new thing. I would think you're right. Okay, well, that looks that looks fantastic. And now we move to the North Bay. Yes, Noble Folk in uh -huh. Healdsburg. I, I don't know if you spend much time in Healdsburg, but there is a really well-known bakery up there. Uh, oh, Mustache there? Baked Goods. Uh -huh. They're in the square, so they opened up a second location just across the square. And this is... Oh, pie and ice cream, oh, which, yeah. if, I mean, that's an American tradition, sure right? Is. So they do these beautiful, wonderful, locally sourced ingredients and flavors mm -hmm. like um, four barrel coffee ice cream. You can get juniper honey, English breakfast, oh. and put it on top of a slab of strawberry ginger oh. pie, thyme loganberry <laughs> apricot pie, salted honey pie. And if you don't like that, they have affogato, which is espresso poured over ice cream. Oh, my. Well, you know that viewers all over the Bay Area are now salivating. Yes, I could eat that for breakfast. <laughs> of course. So, Noble Folk, they're relatively new. Only been uh -huh. up in a few months, but they are making their mark in Healdsburg. Well, they sure are. It looks fantastic. All of these, as usual, the uppers oh, have come through. I'm hungry right now just I thinking too. about it. I am, too. I want it. some ice cream. We're going to take a break and then have some Sundays, okay? We'll be right back. Cheers.